All right, what is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It is VMP here. Welcome back to a little more of Prophecy of Pandora. So, uh, it has been a little while since the last episode, not too long. And there actually was a live stream of Prophecy of Pandora since the last episode. So, if you want to go back, you can watch that. Uh, basically, what we did is we just kind of fucked around and took over a couple castles. Try to What I was trying to do was set up this episode where our goal is going to be taking over Yanos and Ethos to kind of fully secure the old Empire lands. And uh, at that point, I think we might actually be good and done with this war with Dishar. For the time being, obviously. Eventually, we're going to have to come back and finish off the rest. But, I mean, you remember, at the beginning of this war, man, Dishar had, like, this. They had all, whoops, all of this and all of this. Um, we have done quite a good job of pushing them back. Uh, and if, if we're successful in taking Ethos and Yanos, they're basically back to what they start with, plus Nudar, Castle, and Valibre, and, and that's it. So really not too bad. Um, however, <laughs> kind of glossing over the fact that taking Yanos and Ethos is not going to be easy. I actually already went in on a, on my first Siege of Yanos, took out about a hundred of them, um, 150 or so, and uh, it wasn't, it's not bad, it's not a bad castle. Um, is, it's just, you really got to set your archers up right away. So, uh, I'll kind of show you guys what I'm talking about here in a sec. Although, I feel like they might sally out. I feel like they might sally out because we obliterated them in the KD last time. Yep, so they're going to sally out. That's fine. I kind of anticipated this and moved my archers lower down so that our infantry would be the first one to go in. All right. Charge in, everybody. Here we go, here we go. We need to win this. We need to win this. What we're gonna do is sabotage... Fuck, they're back. Mind if I can get this fucker off of me. Oh, come on. I need to take out the archers, buddy. I ain't got time for you. Chill out. Alright, here we go, here we go. We cannot let them set their archers up. Keep in mind, hmm, Prophecy of Hendor, the devs made that stupid-ass uh, choice to uh, make it so that the siegers in sally outs don't get ammo <laughs> so our archers would be useless in this sally out unlike theirs that actually set up and just wreck us however us harassing them here has done an amazing job of stopping them from shooting our troops so our knights of the eventide and whatnot have been able to clean up their infantry and now they can move on to these guys so that actually went pretty well i mean we didn't get a ton of kills yeah you know, 18 not horrendous 18 out of the 85, but uh, that, was, that was more impact than, than you would have thought there, than the kills show. Good enough. 60 renown for that. Thank you. Holy shit. Um, I mean, low-key, like, we can do that again if y'all want, because uh, that was a piece of cake. <laughs> that was easy. Um, all right. Well, now we're ready for the regular or the rest of the siege. So let me get my ranged troops and put them right back up. They're actually going to lead the charge now. We only lost one night of the eventide there. Perfect. That's what you love to see. There we go. All right, let's do this, lads. Uh, okay, everyone here, uh, do that, and then everyone not archers up there. I don't know if that was the easiest way to do that, but whatever. We are gonna hide behind this tree, play a little peekaboo with him. What do we what do we got over here? Oh my god, those are not pretty units that you got there, buddy. What was that? A maiden scout? Holy fuck. Man, alright. Uh oh jeez. Right, I was gonna say that it sure have fallen upon tough times, but I think that main scout was a fluke because the rest of them are uh kinda of fucking us up right now. We do have a lord here with us. I didn't have a lord here with me last time, so it was basically just my archers against theirs. But this, but now this lord's troops are going to be with us, and he doesn't have a lot of great archers, and so his troops are kind of diluting mine. Hmm, I'm not sure if I'm a fan of that. I mean, he does have some nice, you know, knight of the lion units. Like this guy. I mean, this is a good lord, you know, for you know. Other normal battles, but that's not how we take down these castles. Was it you? Was it you? Holy shit. Three for three. Four for four. Can we go five for five from downtown? 
Oh, there goes all my arrows. Um, are you dead yet? Oh, wait, no, I need to just, I forgot. I can do this. Boom. There we go. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Thank you very much. 47 new arrows, just like that. Easy peasy. Alright, take him out. Take you out. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. See, this is good. Now we've actually got our archers set up. We took out, you know, the majority of their ranged units. Obviously, they're going to get more reinforcements, and some of those are going to be archers. But the majority of their ranged units are gone, and so now it's just our archers teeing off on them. Uh, mixed in with a bit of uh, us popping off as well. Oh, juicy. Nice little headshot there. You love to see it. Yeah, these are kind of not their, not their best units, man. I'm seeing, like, some guys wearing furs. Not the good kind, not like the, you know, the Gucci furs, like just some, some broke furs, you know what I'm saying? Uh, alright. <laughs> Taking out 68 of them so far. Over half of those have been my own. Thank you very much. I think we are going to have to charge in on these dudes at some point, but they still outnumber us. Well, not as by as much anymore since we do have a lord with us. I need to remember that we do have the lord and he's packing at least 100 troops. I didn't see exactly how many he had. But he's given us a decent amount of extra troops. Oh God, I hate it's so hard to hit guys with a, have a shield and like a throwing weapon, man. There's like a tiny, like a tiny little area that you can sneak the area past, and it's only when they're like about to throw. Like they have to be in a certain position, and then you can sneak an arrow in, and that's about it. Is that one of you guys? Who's that? Is, it, is that a, that's another? Oh, main warden this time. Well, slightly better than the main scout. Alright, next set of arrows. Thank you very much. Wait, we're still out of arrows left over in the other one? Oops. Not really off. GG. Oh, headshot, though. I love this bow, man. I'll come back from playing like a World of Ice and Fire, and I just forgot how fast and how accurate this bow is, man. It's insane. And, like, the speed's getting decent on it, too. Like, when I when I was talking about, like, how fast the, the this bow is, I was talking about, like, the, the missile speed on this is like a like a sniper. But, like, the speed of that we that we can fire it is actually getting pretty decent as well with all those Qualys gems that we've been turning into elixirs. Really not too bad. Really not that bad at all. Okay. Well... This is going pretty well. I'm going to keep this up for a little bit, and I'll be right back. Uh, potentially going to do another, like, leave and then come back. Let our troops heal up and then come back in. I'll have to see how I'm feeling. 480 <laughs> archery proficiency there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's 69 kills. I think I think 69 kills is a pretty good number to leave off on. We've taken out 137 of them and only lost 9 troops ourselves. I mean... Oh, wait, oops, nope, don't want to do that, don't want to do that. This is one of the few battles where you can actually just walk to the edge, and it's actually really easy to walk to the edge and not take that run-on hit. And we'll give our troops some more time to get another kill, maybe? There we go, Empire Mortal. Good stuff, good stuff. Retreat. We only lost two there. Our ally lost five, or three. Yeah, really not. I had 69 out of the 85. Come on, man, that's embarrassing. Boys need to pump those numbers up. Uh, okay, well, let's move these guys back down. Uh, let's move these guys back down, and we'll come right back in. Actually, we should probably, like, rest off for a sec, right? And check out what their numbers are looking like. Oh, down to 290 already, man. Yeah, that was big. That was big. All right. Wait, that's not right. Oh, that, that kill feed was from the last battle that I had. That makes more sense. Okay. I was like, there's no way we killed, yeah, I just looked. We killed like 140 troops. It wasn't, we didn't kill 80 of them. There we go. All right. Think about ready. Yep, Sally out. Kind of what I thought. That's fine. Charge! 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 charge. Get in there. All right. Okay, you're going to just, huh. Chamber block me. Makes sense. That's the hard AI, baby. They can pull off advanced moves. They're not even intending to, is the best part. It happens completely on accident when they chamber block you, and it's always frustrating. I still need to learn how to do that. I, like, I don't understand how it happens. Like, I know what, like, roughly what happens, but I can't get it to go consistently. 
you lads. One, two. I only have three arrows. <laughs> Fuck this game. All right, come on, give me in here, give me in here. Oh yeah, even tied. Yes. Walk him down, boys. Walk him down. Yeah, you think it's real funny how you guys have arrows and we don't. Boom. Oh, look at that. Look at that, like, four-piece to end the battle. Not too shabby. Good stuff. We are a little banged up, but that's okay. That's okay. We only lost four units and all that. Oh, my God. Good stuff. All right. Go right back here. Bring them back into the fold. Come on, come on, come on. Mm, you too. Boop, 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 boop. All right. Mm -mm -mm. There we go. I'll try it like that this time. See if that if that helps anymore. Now, what are the numbers looking like? How many were killed in the last one? Eighty. How many? Did, how many was in this alley out? Like eighty of them. So they should be down to like two hundred even. Something like that. I will right, we'll let our archers do a little bit of work, and then we're just going to charge it. I'm not going to waste everybody's time before another battle. We're just going to finish this one off right here and now. They're not, I mean, look at yeah. Ooh, wait, Empire Immortal. Hello. I was about to just say they don't have many good units left. Uh, another Empire Immortal. What the fuck? They've been saving these guys for the end? What the hell? But the rest of them, yeah, conscripts wearing the, the Fuchi, the fake Gucci furs. Not too, uh, not too threatened by that. All right, good stuff, good stuff. Oh, so, by the way, happy 4th of July, everybody, man. Uh, I kind of forgot about that. Hope uh, everybody has had a good time. Lighting off some fireworks, maybe. I was, uh, it was me and, uh, some of you, some of the longtime subscribers will remember, uh, Nick, or, uh, or Gerbs, as we sometimes call him. It was just uh, me and him tonight. We're setting off a few fireworks and then saving some for uh, Saturday when we're going up to a friend's cottage and it's on a lake. And it should it should be fun, man. I'm looking forward to it. Uh, there's only going to be like five of us, but every house at the lake is is like is out there to party too. So there's like 70 more people. <laughs> so it should be a good time. I'm looking forward to it. And we'll be uh, we'll be sending some more off there. How many of you guys remember? Uh, I think it was two Fourth of Julys ago. We, I recorded the video of it. We blew up a microwave <laughs> with a bunch of mortar shells. You guys remember that? I don't remember that. I put that in the middle of an episode. I think it was like two two years ago. Good times, man. Good times. We didn't do anything quite that crazy this year. At least not yet. We still have half our fireworks left for Saturday. But we were like, you know. Um, we set, we set a couple off, and we were like, alright, that wasn't too bad. And then we were like, er, well, we, I was the one who, who started most of this. Um, <laughs> I don't want to blame Nick for, for these shenanigans. It was definitely on me. Um, I was like, you know what? I kind of want to set one of these mortars off while holding the tube. And I did that, and holy shit, that was loud, but it was awesome. The kick on it was great. It, it felt like, you know, you were actually holding, like, uh, a mortar tube. Like, it was just, like, I was just holding it there, held it, like, a 45 degree angle. It was just like, whoop! <laughs> and then it, w it went off and exploded. And so then, obviously, the next logical step was to light one of the mortars hold while holding it in your hand and then chuck it as far as you could. So I did that, and that went pretty well. And, uh, it ended with us setting off a couple on the ground where we were hiding, like, 10 feet away from it behind, like, a little bit of a barrier. So, uh, yeah. I'm a smart guy. <laughs> Definitely very, very safety-minded, dude. Or whatever the fuck you want to say. Uh, alright, lads. I think it's time to bring the boys on in. Even though we are still kicking their ass. I've already killed 112 of them. Let's bring the boys on in and finish this one off. Honestly, we should probably even bring in the archers, too. Just bring in everybody. We don't actually have the many infantry. Seriously, it's, it's all archers. That's alright. Get in there, boys. Let's choose this one. There's a little bit of a shorter line, I think. So we'll see. I, to be fair, I'm, make, I'm probably making it sound a lot worse than it actually was when I was screwing around with the fireworks. I was, we were being careful. I wasn't, you know, 
I mean, okay, I can't say we're being careful, careful, but we weren't being, like, needlessly reckless. Well, I mean, arguably, any risk we took was definitely reckless. So it was kind of reckless. But it wasn't horrendously. It wasn't like I was putting myself in a lot of danger or anything like that. Not trying to... One of my buddies, uh, his, uh, his dad actually lost an eye to, uh, to fireworks a couple years ago. He's the local, uh, local weatherman, actually, and so he has, a, he has a glass eye now, but he was wearing an eye patch for a good long while there. Ah, uh, they're almost done. 21 more? Bitch, where? What? I thought we were done with this shit. There are a couple of them huddled on in there. Push, push, ten more. There we go. Yeah, we're almost there. Seven, six, five. It's taking a lot longer than I thought for our trained army to kill a couple of Dashar conscripts and hunters. Who's this last guy left? Oh, right there. Empire Immortal. Good stuff. Very good siege there, actually. We did not take many losses at all in that entire ordeal. That's what you love to see. Alright, alrighty then. Ooh, ooh. Hello. <laughs> Hello there. Obi-Wan Kenobi. Um, hmm. Empire Armored Crossbowmen, of course. We'll take the Nobles. Which never recruit. Blackheart Squire, yeah. I guess it's like the regular Crossbowmen too, right? Ooh, main Cavalry. That's a close call. I think we'll take the main cavalry over the nobles and the regular longbowmen for sure. And who's the one last lucky son of a bitch? Oh, wait, what the fuck? Deathwind Savar? Oh my god, hello. Yeah, you boys are in. You boys made the cut. Oh, uh, get rid of you two. Hell yeah. <laughs> Those guys look sick, man. What the fuck? Alright, take all them. Mm, good stuff. All right, cool, cool. Making a lot of money. They've been uh, ransoming off the couple of lords that we've captured so far, and they, man, the Dishar must be rolling deep because they're sending us twenty grand per lord. It's actually fucking insane. <laughs> it's actually insane how much money they're giving us just for these lords. That like, honestly, I would have taken like five k for them, <laughs> but they're offering me twenty k. Actually, right now, I don't know if I would have taken in five k just because. Their numbers are a little worrying. They do overwhelm us a bit. Only 83? You kidding me? We take over a town, you only station 83 in there? When they took over Sarleon, like a week or, a week or so ago in game, they instantly stationed 460. Some BS. Some BS. Alright, that's fine. Whatever. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. You following me? Yes, he's still following me. Yeah, you got a, you got a decent amount of troops there. Brennus Legatus. Never heard of this man before in my life. But 20 Knights of the Lion. Holy shit. You're coming with me, champ. You are coming with me. Forget about those fucks. Who are you? Oh, you're bad tempered? I don't care. With 20 Knights, you're coming with me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright. The last remaining Empire vassal. He's doing pretty well for himself, man. I think he actually has more troops now than the last time we saw him. 171. Uh, who's this? Lord Leofwine. Hmm. Not as many knights. Not awful, though. Honestly, could use his help, because Ethos is beefy. Yeah. 700 in the garrison. 260 or 250 prisoners there. Not bad. That's not too bad. That I don't mind. But the rest of them, man. I do not know. Alright, well, let's do this. Let's see what happens. Yeah, this is gonna be a real quick episode. We can just go in and take this out right here and now. Can I sally out? No. Hmm. Bold choice. Alright, do that. Archers come back. Stand close. Good luck, lads. This? I mean... If we have archer superiority here, you... Oh. Oh. Plague Wardens. No. No. This is one of those castles? Fuck, the Plague Wardens are nasty. They're like Ebony Gauntlet Lights. Oh, no. Okay, we need to... Hopefully they don't have too many of them. Although, with a garrison of 700, I gotta imagine they have, you know, like, a decent number of them. Right, there we go. 
This is gonna be a bloody siege, I can already tell. How where are my arrows going? Thank you. Son of a bitch. Fuck these trees. Nice. Oh, come on. Sneak it in there. Good shit. Good shit. I don't know why I thought I thought I saw a guy like all the way over there. Okay, well this is getting this is getting a little bit better. This isn't as bad. They are getting their reinforcements now. Most of their like initial archers are gone. Hopefully they don't have too many of the uh, plague wardens in this one. Where's that guy? Where's my thing at? Here we go. Oh. Move! Move! Thank you. Jesus. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Why don't I have gauntlets? Did I never pick those up from the stronghold? Holy shit, that was ages ago in game. What am I doing? No wonder we get wrecked by these arrows. We're missing an entire piece of armor. Holy shit, I'm a I'm an idiot. Have you guys been telling me this in the comments and I just haven't seen these messages? What the fuck? Like, I figured at least one person would have saw and started commenting, and then you guys would have never let me hear the end of it. It's been like a year in game since we put those away. Not quite. But at least a couple months they've been done now. Holy shit. I am awful. I'm just horrendous at this. This is what happens when I only play this, like, once every two weeks. So I completely forget what's going on in the series. Man, that's why we need to wrap this up. And I think... I think you guys will see. We don't have that much left of this. We legitimately do not have that much left of this series. Which is good, because I can't wait to take Edward Longshanks and put him into CK2. Oh, I'm so excited for that shit. I'm gonna put him into CK2. He's gonna be immortal. He's gonna be a beast. Oh, it's gonna be... And we're... And because I'm not... I'm not great at CK2, so I... Holy shit, 48 damage. Let's see, if we had gloves, that's like 3 damage right there. Not really. That must have been a headshot from... 66 damage. From... A Gazi Stalker. Actually, not who I thought it was gonna come from, if I'm being honest. How do our boys do here? I wanna... Let's... They're not gonna do right here. Right. Oh, well... Wait a minute. Wait a goddamn minute. They're not doing horrible here. Knights of the Lion are... Actually, doing pretty well for themselves. How many we taken out so far? 140 of them. Okay. None of us have died. Oh, take that back. One of ours just died. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no. Let's get out of here. Let's, let's stop that. Let's stop that. All right, we lost a couple there. We lost a couple there. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. So let's see. He lost 20. We lost four. Really not that bad. Uh, they lost 150. I mean, look, that's not bad, right? That's not bad at all. Uh, okay, so they're down to 600. All right. Okay. All right. What do we look at? How many of these? So yeah, they have 30 Knights of the Radiant Cross and still 19 more of those Plague Wardens. How many of those Plague Wardens did I kill there? I had to have killed at least like 15 of them. I'm sure our troops had some more too. They had like 50 of them to start. Gotta love it. Um, but once we get past those, all right, 25 Gazi Stalkers. Those are pretty good. But... Besides those guys, it's not, you know, nothing crazy, man. Nothing that crazy. I mean, besides, you know, the normal Dishar overpowered units. Okay. Really not that bad. Really not that bad. God, I get the feeling that they're going to sally out on this one, but I'm not 100% sure. Because we did take a decent amount of losses. They didn't sally out. Perfect, 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 perfect. Okay. Everybody up. Archers back. Stand close. And like you like each other. Alright. Rip mate, rip mate. Rip you too. Alright, this time I'm hanging behind these juicy little archers. They can protect me. Because that tree was not working for me. We couldn't shoot out from behind it half the time. And it was not protecting the shots coming from the other direction. <laughs> So, I don't... Oh, those are dead bodies I'm shooting at right there. 
<laughs> the plague warden like ducked. Our arrow went past and shot the guy behind him. Like the guy behind him like thought he was safe, thought he was covered. And then nope. The man ducked and then he got he got railed. Where is my shot going? Thank you. Thank you. Alright. Why to then? Shoot back guy. Got still a decent amount of these plagues left, man. There we go, another one. I'm just trying to hunt them now. Uh, at least it wasn't a headshot. Those last two shots from Holy fuck, this man is targeting us. He's got aimbot. What a guy. This is that guy right there too, I'm pretty sure. Is he dead now? He might have died. He might be dead now. We're not entirely sure. Where? Bitch, where were you? <laughs> where the fuck were you? Holy sh- It was another Gazi stalker, man. These guys call them stalkers for a reason, man. You don't even see them. They guys just be sneaking up on you. Holy shit. I don't like this. Let's get out of here. Get out of here before we lose a bunch more. Okay. Alright. Alright. Let's see what you're doing there. I don't like it. But I respect it. You, you're following us right now. Are you really? Yeah, that's what I fucking thought. Peck off, buddy. You are out of your pay grade. Yeah. Get the fuck on. Is that guy running away? Dude, come on. Quit being a pussy. Alright. Uh, I mean, I guess we are kind of beat up right now. Oh, whoops. I did the wrong thing, that's why. I was sitting there looking for that option, not realizing realizing it, I, I was already into the second, uh, second screen. Ooh. You, you. Yes, come here. Uh, not, well, not you. But you can follow me, too. I want him. Elfline. Elfline the goddess. Get over here. <laughs> that man has two troops in there. Uh, ba ba ba. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Follow me. Oh my god, what a warhammer. That guy looks like a tank. That's who we need. That's who we need right now. Alright, how are we looking? Our troops never didn't really even get touched in that, if we're being honest. Low key, having these extra lords might not even help, because really they just they just kind of fuck you guys for taking or for besieging Sarleon again. Alright, we're taking Ethos for sure. I can take Sarleon in between episodes. I've gotten so used to doing that, it's not even that big of a deal anymore. Alright, I think we had more luck when we were hiding behind these guys, and it wasn't until we, like, moved to the tree that we really started getting targeted, so. Uh, what is this? Is this, like, is this dawn or dusk? I can't tell. I don't like it, though. I mean, it could be worse. It could be, like, actually, like, night, but, man, it's fucking dark and hard to see. Any of those plague wardens anymore? Might have just about rooted them out. Holy fuck, that sun is bright at that angle. We might just about have gotten all of them. Okay. Yeah, we're bringing the hurt now. We have finally secured a range advantage over them. Okay, good to see. Good to fucking see. Yeah, I think I might do some more live streams of this. Because that was fun. Because uh, that allowed me to, like, take over several castles in the time that would have normally taken, like, a full episode to do that. And so that left this episode where we could just take these last two towns and then be done with this war, effectively. So, I think I might do some more streaming of it. And that would kind of, you know, speed up the process of us finishing up the series and getting on to some new ones. So, yeah, I kind of like that idea. Ooh, Gazi Stalker, my, uh... My personal nightmares in this in these sieges. I'm always glad to shoot one of them. What does Gazi mean? I legitimately have no idea. I mean, it's like Benghazi. I don't know, I've heard of Benghazi, but uh, <laughs> uh, the Gazi Strip. No, Gaza Strip, not Gazi. Hmm. I have no idea what Gazi means. Might have to look that up. Is that honestly? It probably doesn't even mean anything kind of sounded Arabic and so they're like yeah let's do that Ghazi warriors Ghazi stalkers whatever the fuck that means all right, all right. I think I might 
just well, begin to the point that we want to charge in, maybe. Well, our archers are still firing full force. Tell you what, I'll be back in a sec once we're done. We're ready to charge in and finish the siege off. Alright, fuck it. I think we're ready. Send it, boys. Full send time. I did have a shield up, I couldn't tell. Alright, so we're going to try to sneak in through this side. Although, basically, all the rest of these guys are coming here, too, so it's not much of a sneak, but that's fine. We're going to try to get over here and hold this side, because I think the reinforcements come to the right. Oh, boys, get me in, get me in. Get me in, lads. Get me hit, and I'm on the wrong side of where I wanted to be. Fight my way out of here now. Fucker. Get me shots where we can. Come on, get me through, get me through, get me through. Get me through. Good. Holy fuck, what is all these, what are all these archers? What the fuck is this? What is this? Why are there so many archers? Someone come help me! Oh my god! Okay, boys coming in now. Holy shit, I was not expecting to turn the corner and see, and to, to see all of them. Jesus. Uh, give me arrows, please. Thank you. Reloaded. And a lot of juicy new targets over here. Good stuff. Alright, alright. All right. We done over here, boys? Taking a sweet time, huh? We have just a tiny sliver of HP left. <laughs> we are on like 2 HP right now. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. That's okay. We are still obliterating them in the kill feed. Man, what, what is our surgery skill? Oh, 10. That's why. So, and since we're the lord, or since we're the leader, that's really 10 plus 4, so 14 surgery. No wonder no one ever dies in our party. That's great. That's perfect. Yeah, baby. Easy mode. How many kills did I get there? Uh, 60? Oh, one away. One away. Lame. Alright, 42 Renom for that. Not too bad. And we gotta keep on going in the streets. There you go, boys. Ooh. This man looks tanky as fuck. Oh, it's the... Yeah, Knight of the Radiant Cross. We're getting to them. In the kill... Or in the, the garrison now. Wait, I'm so slow. I'm afraid one of those crossbows is gonna hit me in the back and it's gonna be over. Fuck you, Spearman. gonna lose this we're actually about to fucking lose this jk my aim is cracked we ain't losing shit oh wait hold on there's still six of them left motherfucker oh no 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 not like this dude not like this Peek. Peek me, bitch. Okay. Three down, three more. Right in the throat. Let's get it. Oh, thought that was it. Nope. Hit him with it. Ah, that wasn't that good. That's fine. <laughs> we'll take it, though. <laughs> oh, let's go, baby. Uh, boy, that was a little nerve-wracking there. We're not done yet, though. Yeah, we gotta take out the castle now. Got another one of those. Nice rating cross. Wow. That guy looks tanky as fuck, man. Seriously, though, those guys are intimidating. They kind of look like the uh, the Twilight Knights from or the Twilight Knight armor. Um, and what am I thinking? Perizno. You know what I'm talking about? Is that actually? It's not the same armor. I'm pretty sure, but I don't know. It just kind of reminds me of it. It's just so beefy. Good stuff. Ooh, what are you, Marshall? Huh? Yeah, you're my prisoner. Give us more uh, leverage, more bargaining power. Our rotten beef. Get rid of that. The other. Uh, that's all good. Good stuff. Uh, anyone want some of this shit? I doubt it, but there we go. Nice! 
Nice, man. Let's go. Good stuff. Uh oh, name adventures. Okay. Uh, armored longbowman. I see you. Knights. Wow. There's actually some good units here. Shadow hunters. I have not played this game in long enough, but that sounds legit. <laughs> Welcome aboard. Uh, if I can find some people to kick. Jesus. It's kind of hard. No wonder we take we take so few losses compared to the Lords, man. Our army is insane right now. Like, it just doesn't have a weak point. Like, we just don't really have weak units. The worst units that we have are, like, mid-tier. 316, like, good units. Uh, I don't even know who to... Just gotta have to kick that guy, right? But he's gonna level up into an Empire Knight. Empire Knights are insane. I, I literally just don't know who we get rid of here. Cobra Warriors, maybe? I guess. Wow. Man. This is a good-looking army. Alright, well, these should go to the Lords, at least, so we're not going to lose out on all these units. Someone's going to get them. It just won't be us. We won't be able to directly control them. That's fine. Alright. Defer appointment, for the time being. Good stuff. What kind of garrison? Ooh, yeah, we got a big garrison there. Eight armored crossmen. Hello. Hello and goodbye to any enemies standing down range. Okay, well, there we go. Another good episode. I think we're going to go ahead and uh, wrap this one up here because it's getting late for me. It's already like 3 a.m. and i got to edit this and try to get it uploaded for you guys tomorrow. Um, so, furthermore, or what we're looking to do in this series now, I'm probably going to, well, in between episodes, I'm going to have to go to either defend Sarleon or wait for them to take it and then retake it. Uh, but I'm going to be looking for peace with the Dishar. And that way we can have a little bit of a break from these episodes where it's just been non-stop sieging, really. And uh, hopefully next episode I want to do some uh, Qualls Gem hunting. Go ahead, go ahead and uh, try to hunt down some unique spawns. Take on some of the ones that we haven't seen yet, if we can. Uh, I think that'd be fun. But anyway, as always, leave some comments down below. Let me know what you're thinking about this series and all the rest of the series we got going on right now. Next episode will be an episode of World of Ice and Fire. Hoping to get that out for you guys this weekend as well. Probably Sunday. Um, but yeah, until then, as always, take it easy.